All right, here we go. We're checking out the 2020 Chevrolet HD versus the regular 1500. And the HD that we're looking at is a Z71 equipped truck with a diesel. So the hood scoop is functional on this truck compared to the gas setup. It's got a 10-speed Allison transmission. And this truck we're looking at for the 1500 is probably powered by the 5.3 V8. So in terms of design, I'd like to see what you guys think. So please comment below which truck you actually prefer in terms of exterior design. I'd like to see what you guys think about that situation. So there's no denying that's an HD truck. I mean, this is very bold in your face. And Chevy definitely uh, really pulled out all the stops on design, especially for this model year. Very comfy. Uh, this truck here, I would say, is a little more subdued. And it's starting to catch on. When I first saw it in person, I was like, yeah, I think Chevy rushed the job here on the redesign, but it's starting to look pretty good now. Let's check out the side profile of the truck. So you got some really monstrous tires on this Z71 setup. And you can clearly see how much taller the cab is compared to the regular 1500. The tow mirrors are pretty expansive. They have a multiple adjustability. And I love the lighting setup on the vehicle as well. So quick look at both cabs, you can clearly see very, 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 very large trucks. Both are redesigned very recently, so it's nice to see Chevy really going all out. Uh, but Ford has definitely uh, dropped a bomb in terms of diesel output. So the new set, Ford makes uh, 475 horsepower and a monstrous 1,050 foot-pounds. So the GM might have to work with the Suzu to operate these motors to keep up. So this torque war is going to get insane. See, once again, this 1500. It's a little bit tight core, so that's uh, the closest I can get at the moment. So my apologies on that. And there's another Silverado just to give you another look. And here's another Duramax without the Z71. So in terms of design, very, very similar. Very, very bold grills. I love the stacked dead lamps on these trucks. There's a major difference between the two in the front end, so definitely a nice uh, distinguished design between both. So I just wanted to do this impromptu video to show you side by side of the vehicles. The tailgates are going to be the same, the real taillights. So the main thing is definitely the front end and also the chassis. So the big, big differences in uh, capability between the vehicles. So thanks for tuning in to the video. Uh, we'll have a lot more content to come. And we'll catch you guys later. Have a great day. All right.